Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I wanted to share with you a few items that I recently purchased from Amazon. These are all fashion items, mostly dresses, but I also got an accessory that some of you might find very familiar. I've never before purchased fashion items from Amazon, so I was very curious because I've heard good things. If you enjoy this video, then please remember to give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you wanna see more content like this. So the first item that I'm gonna share with you guys is not a dress it is an accessory piece and it is this beautiful bracelet that I am wearing right now so this is a look-alike of the Van Cleef and Arpels five motif Alhambra bracelet obviously in the white mother of pearl although this is not mother of pearl this is probably just some kind of ceramic tile or something like that and it is in the gold color obviously not in real gold it's not gold plated either this was only $16 guys and I'm actually very impressed with the way that it looks. It's obviously not the real thing and the reason why I purchased this is not to make it look like I have the real bracelet. I am actually interested in purchasing the real bracelet but it's been a very long time since I've worn bracelets and the style is very distinct so I wanted to get a copy of it that I could wear around and see if it really works with my outfits and my lifestyle and I have to say I am very very impressed with it so far it's very much convincing me to get the real thing but if you have no intention of ever purchasing the real bracelet which is about five thousand dollars when you factor in taxes and everything then I think that this is a great affordable affordable option that looks pretty good compared to the original especially from afar now the biggest thing that gives it away I think is this chain the real bracelets do not have an adjustable chain and Instead, you go in and have it adjusted exactly to your wrist size, but you could very easily cut off the rest of the chain that you don't need if it bothers you to have it just dangling. But overall, I really love this bracelet. I will definitely link it down below. Just note that the pictures online are a little bit different than what it is here, and I think that this one actually looks a little bit better than the version that was online. So just be aware of that. They do have a bunch of colors. This one is obviously in the white, but overall, I think that this is a win. Okay, so next up is the dress that I'm wearing right now. This is a beautiful maxi length dress, one shoulder with an adjustable tie strap, and it kind of has a little bit of a tiered look at the bottom. The print is this beautiful floral, kind of on a blue background with pink and red and greens in it, and I absolutely love this dress. It was $35 and it feels really high quality. The fabric is polyester, which I know is not typically thought of as high quality, but it actually looks really elegant on and this fabric I find doesn't wrinkle very easily. So this dress, I know I'm gonna get a lot of use out of. I think it's the perfect dress to throw on when let's say it's been a long day at the beach or on the boat and you just need to throw on something that it's very comfortable but looks nice that you don't have time to iron and you don't want to be constricted and uncomfortable this is that dress I also do think that because of the fabric that polyester kind of fabric it would actually look really good if you dress it up a little bit with a pair of heels I think you could definitely get away wearing this to a wedding I think it's so beautiful and again the maxi length makes it look really really elegant and super feminine okay so next up we have this really sweet blue floral mini dress it has a smocked bodice and these really cute ruffly straps at the top this dress is very comfortable and lightweight it's a hundred percent viscose and was only $24 I think that this is a great cover-up dress or dress also after you've gone to the beach or doing something really casual very very sweet it obviously needs a little bit of a steam or an iron but that would be really easy to do and for $24 let me know what you guys think. I think it is really freaking cute. Okay, so next up I have another smocked dress, but this one instead is a maxi dress. I obviously got it in the color black, and it does need a bit of a steam as well. This is also in that viscose kind of material, although a little bit thicker than the previous dress, and I do like this dress. It was $43-ish. My only complaint about the dress is that this smocked bodice is really long on me. It goes 
a little bit below my natural waist and I don't really like the look of that on me. However, if you have a larger bust, then I think this would obviously be raised up a little bit more to your natural waist and it would be a really lovely option. Okay, so next up I have another smocked dress, but this one is in a midi length now and it has these beautiful little ruffly sleeves here that remind me a lot of the Hill House dress style, which I have been interested in, but obviously this is a much smaller price tag. This dress retails for $35 and the material is polyester, so it's a little bit silkier and a little bit less prone to wrinkling than the viscose dresses. I do still think that it needs a little bit of esteem on the skirt, but overall, I really like this dress. I think it fits really well in the bodice area, and what's nice about these straps is that they're tight enough where you can wear them down across the arms and make it into this really sweet strapless design, which I think is very feminine as well. And at $35, I think that this is a great, great buy. Okay, so the next dress that I have is another maxi dress, also smocked bodice with the adjustable tie straps. This one is in polyester and is $40, and I really, really love this dress also. I love the maxi length. It's so easy and very comfortable. I do think it could use a little bit of a steam or a light iron, but the polyester it does make it a little bit more resistant to wrinkles than the viscose. For $40, I think that this is a great option. My only complaint is that, again, the bodice here is a little bit big for me. There seems to be a little bit of fabric when I move side to side. You can maybe see a little bit of the rippling here and there. It doesn't bother me all that much, though, and if you had a larger bust, then that would definitely not be an issue for you. But, again, it doesn't really bother me. Overall, I like the dress a lot. I think I'm still going to keep it anyway. Okay, and last but definitely not least is this beautiful ruffly floral feminine mini dress with beautiful billowy sleeves and I got it in this really pretty white and blue fabric but they do have a bunch of different color options as well now this I am so impressed with this goes for $39 and it looks just like some of the dresses that I've purchased from Revolve for $200 it is so similar. The quality, I'm so impressed with. The way that it fits is amazing. It fits my waist perfectly. We do have a little bit of an open back. I'm wearing it with a bra because it is a little bit big for me in the chest area, but you could absolutely wear it without a bra or you could do sticky boobs if you don't want to see it in the back, but you do want a little bit more coverage in this area. But overall, I am so impressed. Again, I think it's such good quality. The sleeves also can go down a little bit more if you want them to be a little bit of a longer length, but I kind of like that pushed up just a little bit to show a bit more skin. This is lined, which is really nice, so nothing's going to be see-through. And this one, you do not have to worry about steaming or ironing because it's meant to be this ruffly design and it's like this polyester sheer material anyway. Overall, I think this one is absolutely a win. All right, guys, but that's all that I have for you in this video. Let me know down in the comments which of these was your favorite or if you purchased other dresses from Amazon that you think are really great buys. But if you enjoyed this video, then and please give it a like and subscribe down below and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye!